Good morning, kindergartners, and good morning, Lamar. Thank you for joining me this morning. I'm in my happy place right here in my room, and the only thing missing are those 15 happy faces that are usually smiling up at me. I miss you so much, but I hope you're listening, and I hope you enjoy today's devotional. The name of our story is Giving God Thanks. And our Bible verse is, Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His love endures forever. A Sunday school teacher in her class made up a litany one Sunday morning. Now, a litany is a prayer in which one person says the first part of the sentence and others finish the last of the sentence. This morning, I'm hoping that you're going to join me as I say the first part and then you say the second part with me. It says, Dear God, we are thankful. I'm ready to begin with our thankful prayer. For sending Jesus to be our Savior, dear God, we are thankful. For his Holy Bible, dear God, we are thankful. For parents who teach us about Jesus and his love, dear God, we are thankful. For our church and our church school, dear God, we are thankful for making us your children. Dear God, we are thankful for our family and our home. Dear God, we are thankful for your love and care and blessings. Dear God, we are thankful. The Bible says it is a good thing to give thanks to the Lord. It is a good thing because he deserves to be thanked for being kind to us each and every day. It's also good for us because it makes us happy when we think of how good God is to us and when we praise and thank him. We thank God when we pray, when we sing, and when we share him with others at home, at church, and at our school. Of course, we can thank him in other ways too by showing our love. It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord, so let's do it often, alone and together. Now, at the end of our stories, we usually ask questions about what we've read, but instead today, I'm going to ask you to do something even more important, and that is to start a thankful journal of your own. You can even ask your parents and other friends over the phone what they're thankful for, too. You'll be amazed at how long your list will be. Now I would like to ask you to put your hands together and close your eyes and bow your head with reverence and respect. Let us give thanks to the Lord. Dear God of all grace, we want to thank you for all that you have done for us and for your ongoing care and provisions. There is great comfort in your constant presence. Thank you most of all for sending your son Jesus our precious Lord and Savior, and loving us as your children. Help us to show our love to you each day as an expression of thanks and our wholehearted gratitude. Amen. Have a thankful day. Bye-bye now.